All right, good afternoon. Now we are in the interior and I have taken out the interior light here with the uh, uh, push button or the actuator for the sunroof. And uh, we're investigating now our heat sensor. This is the actually in-car temperature sensor. And this is the hose here I was talking about, which goes down to the lower compartment and it sits about back here. So in order to get this out, you have to remove the lower dash assembly, the cover underneath it, then take out the airbag or hand glove box. And you may have to remove the duct as well because that comes down from here, going down the A column and comes out here and it hooks up to the pump. And that little pump is not working. And the way Mercedes-Benz got this, which is really funny, is I got the uh, tube here. So what they want you to do is to turn on the ignition and then here comes the toilet paper test. I've got a piece of toilet paper here and you hold this on here. Uh, we got sign on the car, right? If we get this thing at the work, then we're gonna be a lot better off. And the air drawn should hold the toilet paper to the hose. And that's not the case, which means the pump is out. It's on one of the fuses. And when you have the fuses checked, you have no power there, then that pump is out. Like I said, if that pump runs as soon as you turn on the ignition without even starting the car or turning on the uh, air conditioning unit. We can give it a test so you can see it. Let me turn this on and see if we have, uh, if that's holding here now. No, that was our air. So the, uh, there's no vacuum. And what this does is it's, it sucks the air over the uh, thermocouple in here or the NTC the thermistor and this is a 10 kilo ohm unfortunately we may not be able to zoom in but you can read it i will test this one out and that one is just soldered into the two connectors on the bottom and i may just change this out now since i got it already out this would be the element which plugs in here and you want to clean this out because there's a lot of dirt in there as you can imagine from that air moving through. So you probably want to blow this out with compressed air. But this is when the air conditioning goes erratic because this sensor here uh, does no longer function properly, not because it is electrically bad, but because of the pump. I just wanted to let you know that. Have a great evening.